ثاني اول تو روتري كلاب اوف سلمانيا ويكلي فيرتشوال ميتينغ سبيشال ويلكم تو اور جيست سبيكر فور توداي بروفيسور غسان الوسي اند هيز توبيك ويل بي ذا فيوتشر اوف كانسر تريتمنت بروفيسور غسان الوسي هي از ذا فاوندينغ بارتنر اند سي او اوف اي اوكسجين ليميتد هي از ان اي ان تي كونسلتنت head and neck surgeon specializing in head and neck malignancy at Barts Health and University College Hospitals. He sub-specializes in skull-based tumors where he pioneered endoscopic surgical approaches to the skull base. He's heavily involved in academia and research and is a co-director of the Head and Neck Academic Center at the University College of London. Um, explaining to you what, what is immunotherapy, uh, how does it work, and then take you through the different types that uh, are currently in use uh, or in research. And then finally take you to my specialist area uh, of immunotherapy, which is the use of oncolytic viruses. But the worst part of this is still, in terms of our current topic, which is immunotherapy, is that all of these treatments uh, can have a significant or will have a significant impact on the immune system. Immunotherapy is to harness the body's natural defenses to fight cancer. Today we have uh, over uh, 20 cancers with immunotherapies approved as a treatment. When the virus replicates in tumor cells and lyses them, it releases hidden tumor-associated antigens. These new previously hidden antigens are now recognized by antigen-presenting cells, most commonly dendritic cells. The dendritic cell's main function is to process antigen material and present it on the cell surface to prime naive cytotoxic T cells against these tumor associated antigens. These newly primed T cells would then go on to attack and kill other tumor cells that have the same tumor associated antigen not previously recognized by the immune system. So, in summary, uh, an oncolytic virus like the one that we have is a common cold virus over here, the one that I've done the most work on. And I've been working on different types of viruses since 2004 uh, and uh, have looked at many different aspects. And uh, I believe this to be the, the most powerful that we've had. These viruses effectively um, break down the cells, releasing these tumor-associated antigens, which then effectively vaccinate the body against these antigens, which are normally hidden. Um, I'm very happy to take any questions. Um, uh, thank you very much indeed for listening. Thank <music> you.